Please subscribe and ring the bell to never miss an update. Today on Lady Mary Bath, we are back at the Hope Chest Resale Market, a charity resale that benefits the Cypher area schools and community. Come along and see what they've got in this lovely boutique today. Hope Chest is a boutique style resale shop with tabletop home decor and fashion finds. They're located in Houston, Texas off of 290 in Barker, Cyprus. And lots of deals and stay tuned, I have some wonderful news to share about this shop. It's a warm welcome here at Hope Chest Resale Market and they've got a lovely display with a decorative clock, willow tree, figurines. Of course we all love Texas so that would be perfect for so many families here. And I'm also seeing these candle holders. They're hand painted, made in Portugal with a beautiful back stamp. Aren't they lovely? And they're $8 for the pair. I'm definitely going to grab these. They always have some nice treasures here in the case. In fact, some ladies ahead of us grabbed some carnival glass and other beautiful items. Here's some Wedgwood Jasperware. It's near and dear to my heart. And I actually have some in this pattern. This is $15. And I think I bought mine in the 90s, so that gives you an idea of the age. And this is $12. Aren't those great pieces? I'll have to think about those today. And they also have collectibles above with the precious moments. And look at this hand-painted Nippon cup and saucer for $10. Isn't that beautiful? So definitely open the case. You never know what you'll find when you're resale shopping. So many beautiful collections here, and some of these are precious moments, others are similar items. And now let's go into my favorite section. It's all about dishes. And I see a familiar pattern here that we will talk more about. Isn't that lovely and perfect for spring and summer? Lots of great colors you could set tables with. This is the rim soup bowl. And it's called mariposa, which is butterfly in Spanish. It's always nice to see a variety of dishes from different eras and they never disappoint in this area. They always have a wonderful selection of china. Some are vintage and some are newer patterns. And surprisingly, I always find Villaroy and Bach when I'm here. This is the Mariposa pattern. I think it came out in the late 90s and it's lovely for breakfast. I have a friend in Germany that has this pattern. And the best part is it has a beautiful back stamp and it says Metlach which is the headquarters for Villa and Bach. That's about 25 minutes from our village in Germany. And it's got the castle there in Medlach. It's absolutely a beautiful pattern and very well priced. So many different eras represented here. These look like they might be mid-century and here are some that are even older. And keep in mind, this can also be for wall hangings or on a display, perhaps on a bookshelf. There's some great vintage pieces and patterns here. I wanted to point this out. A set of six Haviland Limoges plates for $12. These have been hand painted. They would have been blanks originally. And these were painted by someone with the initial A, Love. 2-09, so that has to mean 1909. These are really antiques. And they're all different patterns. Take a look at these. Someone put a lot of thought and care into all of these different designs. The poppies are my favorite. Aren't those lovely? And what a great deal. That would be a nice addition to your tea table. Or you could simply display them. And I wanted to point this out. This very much resembles the Haviland Rosaline pattern, but it's actually not. It has a back stamp of embassy and vitrified china, which is something in Germany is called vitro porcelain. It is similar to bone china and it's Definitely a lot more durable, and you don't see that anymore on back stamps here. These are some great pieces of china. Now it's time for some fashion fun. And I just love how they arrange everything so beautifully so that you can imagine the accessories going with the outfits. And this mulberry color is a Makowski brand. I have seen this, I believe, at Macy's and Dillard's, and that is leather. 
It's in like new condition for $50. And you'll also want to check their monthly sales and I will link their website in the video description and you can take a look at that. They do have um, lots of great opportunities to save even more on some of these categories. And it's really hard for me to pay retail for fashion because I'm always at these great thrift stores and just it really has to impress me to want to pay full price. That's a great opportunity to save some money and to have a variety all under one roof. And it's great that you can get accessories as well. And many of their items are donated. They're brand new, maybe from a local boutique, as these are probably because there are just so many of them. And then others are donated from the community. And that's what makes it so special is you have a variety some fashionable caps and sun hats. And of course we're in Texas, so there's gotta be a cowboy hat too. And they were actually quite busy today. It's really a great spot to pop over on your lunch hour because it's not too big of a store. There's a Chico's jacket. And this is Ann Taylor, look at that. Wouldn't that go with just about any outfit? And great for traveling too. And maybe it's not quite the season, but you're taking a trip to a colder climate and resale really is a great opportunity for that as well. Because if you go to your local retail store, they're only going to have in season clothing. Here's a cabbie jacket. This is Carol Anderson, my invitation sold through distributors. And that probably would be about $150. And here it is $4. Even if you have to have it altered, it's still quite the deal. Vince Camuto, I believe that's a Dillard's brand. I just really like the variety when shopping at a thrift store. And look, here are some brand new tennis shoes. Lots of charity resales have regular donations from high-end stores in the area, and this is a great example. There's a well-known shoe store that donates every couple of weeks to the store, and there are brands like Hoka, Brooks, and also Nike. And they start at $20 here and retail, some of these are 150 or more. And they're very much enjoyed by nurses because of the comfortability. So. so check your local charity resale to see what items they get regularly donated. There was lots of interest today with this footwear. So many customers were interested in saving some money and getting a top quality brand. Now let's take a look at some of the other handbags and accessories. This is a Vera Bradley, very popular brand that comes in many different patterns and it is machine washable. And it is $10, that's a great price. And here's another Vera Bradley. This is a toilet true bag or a cosmetic pouch. And I would use this for jewelry, for oversized bracelets and statement necklaces. And $8 is a deal. I almost bought it, but I put it back because I had so many things today. Here's another Vera Bradley. And you see lots of items that are new with tags. And you can always use these small little bags for just about anything for travel. And wallets are also great here at Hope Chest. This is a fossil brand. I have a garage sale Vera Bradley 50 cent wallet that I've been using for about a year and I finally retired it and now I'm using my Brahmin handbag. And now I will give you a sneak peek into some of these beautiful handbags and sunglasses that will soon be featured at Hope Chest. We're in the back room now where they receive all of the handbags and accessories. And I wanted to show you some of the great brands they have. This pink glitter Kate Spade bag is $65. It's in excellent used condition. I really like the look of this. You can fit so much in it. And they have brands such as Vera Bradley. This looks like an insulated tote. A brand new coach bag, new with tags. Isn't that lovely? And it's not priced yet. I see Pioneer Woman, Dooney Burke, Coach, so many great brands here and they even have an interesting belt. That looks like fun. And how about some Tiffany & Company readers? Doesn't everyone need to have these? <laughs> sort of a retro look, aren't they lovely? It's got a nice little purple tone to it. And they have some Coach sunglasses. And these are all items that will be going out on the floor soon. They're donated by members of the community and it all goes to a good cause. Now let's go back into the housewares section where I see some beautiful glasses. And these look to be vintage with beautiful etching. I think that definitely elevates your everyday with a beautiful pattern to enjoy your 
morning juice or perhaps with your evening meal. Even just water, I think, tastes better out of these glasses. I'm such a fan of the Libby Glass Company's Rock Sharp Crystal from the 1930s. We use these for our everyday glasses. This is the Halifax pattern. Isn't it beautiful? This is the ice beverage. They also have the saucer champagnes and goblets, which could be for water or for wine. It's very well priced, eight pieces for $40. And where can you go and get this quality and craftsmanship? And I especially like the saucer champagnes. You find these a lot in antique shops and resale stores because people just don't want to use them anymore, but they're great for serving desserts. I use mine for orange juice in the morning. And lots of great vintage glass finds here. I love cart diving. Let's take a look at some of the new items that are about to hit the floor. Some of my best finds are from carts. This is a glass container. I wonder if that was before Tupperware. And that certainly would hold a large fruit salad. I like that. And speaking of fruit, here is a lemon tray. Be perfect for by the pool for $6. And I absolutely adore vintage glass and crystal. And this vase is absolutely stunning. Look at all of that etching. Even the rim has detail. This is a steal. I'm definitely taking this home. And here is my little cubby near the register where I'm starting to put all of my purchases. And this really is my favorite section. I find some great deals here on those glass shelves. And it's really a smattering of items. You see some new pieces, but a lot of times you see vintage and antique glass. Some great finds here in the glass and crystal section. This was on the other shelf area. It's $9. It's the Iris herringbone pattern from the Jeanette Glass Company. Isn't that gorgeous? You might remember I found a pitcher at a garage sale in this same pattern. Let me show you some of the other finds here. This looks like it's from another era, and I think it might be Newton crystal in the King's pattern. There are some goblets that have the same design, and for $8, I'm definitely taking this home today. And look at this Imperial Glass Company pattern. It's the Cape Cod. You probably have seen this in cake stands and other designs. $5 for the pair. What an amazing deal. And they actually have two different sets of these. It would be a great gift. Where can you go and spend $5 and have something wonderful? And here is a covered sugar bowl with a matching creamer. And it's only $8. Look at that, another great gift. I encourage you to shop resale, especially charity resales for gifts. And for $4.50, this it looks like American Brilliant Cut Glass. You could use this dish for so many different things. You could put lemon wedges, use it for jewelry on your vanity, or even after dinner chocolates. So many beautiful finds here today. They also have an upstairs in this time of year. It has children's clothing and luggage. And at Christmas time, that's their holiday area. And look at all of this artwork. We're going to walk down the hall. Here is a Strasbourg print. Absolutely gorgeous, beautifully matted. And this is a preview to some of the artwork that we will see in the back. There are also some linens here, but we're going to take a quick walk past and discover the back room. And in the warehouse, they have lots more artwork and furniture. And there are even some new items that we will discover as well. And some really great project pieces. I've seen some of these painted in antique shops. I'm sure you're savvy and know exactly what to do with these. And the price is right. And in the very back of the warehouse, they have some collectibles and they're beautifully arranged. Let's take a closer look. We're now in the warehouse section of the resale shop. You simply go out the back door through the store and here you are. And they have lots of furniture, lamps, and all kinds of accessories. This is sort of the last chance area. And isn't this a lovely beer sign of the Cologne Cathedral? It says Deutschland. It's $8. And a little bit of history on beer steins. They're called Bierkrug in German. It's not stein. Stein means stone. And if you're a tourist and you go to Germany, they won't know what you're talking about. In the 1800s, there was something called the Reinheitsgebot, a standard of cleanliness. And that's why they have lids, to help prevent the spread of disease. There's another really neat one here with a playing card motif and a pewter lid. And it's $10. 
and it is marked made in Germany. So these are some great finds. You never know what you'll see. So go to the back room and discover all the treasures. Here is a creamer from Quebec. Someone obviously has done some world traveling. It's $3. It has a bit of crazing, but you could certainly put some flowers in that and enjoy that on your table. And here are some repurposed pieces of driftwood made into artwork. And if you have a beach house in Galveston, that certainly would be perfect. I found a bear skin for my daughter here recently. And usually in the back, you find some unusual things. So take a look if you pop into Hope Test Resale. Here's a Barley Twist inspired grandfather clock. And it's only $100. Where can you go and get anything like that? Such a deal. And here are some German cups. These belonged with a punch bowl, but not the kind of punch we would serve. This was an alcoholic beverage. And the punch bowl actually has a lid. And here's some lighting wear. I love shopping resale because you can certainly rebuild it. If you have some good bones, good quality classic brass lamp, then you can add your own lampshade and finial and get very creative. And so many people are maybe redecorating or that type thing and they just donate their excess items to their local charity resale and you can certainly benefit from that. Look at this antique wardrobe. I think that's probably from about the 1930s. That's when blonde wood was popular. It's $450. And take a look at this. It even has a spot for hats, complete with an original label. And I spy a piano. Oh, how neat. That's unusual to find one that looks antique, but it's labeled as electric. You see the cord hanging down? And it has already sold for $100. These are some of the new items that I was mentioning. Some area businesses have surplus goods and they donate to Hope Chest. And you can have a microwave or a Sealy mattress for a deal. Another reason to pop in often as they get new products in all the time. Let's go back into the boutique and take a look at some of their beautiful displays. They have so many wonderful pieces of art and accessories. Look at this little violinist with her dog. That's a classic look. I think I've seen that before. And having things framed is so costly that it's definitely more affordable to shop your local thrift store. Then you could certainly change up the look of your home very affordably, even adding something like the brass shell bookend. And look at this glazed candle holder for $6 and you get the candle with it. I think the candle alone would probably cost three or $4. This is a very Texas look. Let's turn it over. It's the Canyon Ranch collection from Kohl's. Brand new, 1699, you're only paying $7. This is one of my favorite finds today. It's screen printed onto linen and it's from a place called The Brook and it was priced at $55 originally and you can have it for $18. And they have some nice vases and statement pieces you could certainly add to your kitchen or den. And these glazed pottery pieces are from Southern Living at Home. And for $9, I'm sure that's a lot more affordable than when they were brand new. In fact, shipping probably would have cost you that much per item. And if you're having a wild themed party, those tigers would be just perfect. And always look on the lower shelves because you never know what you'll find. Here's a lovely wall clock. Looks like it needs a little bit of work. It's $115. And they have a small wedding section with some essentials, things that you could add to your special day. And the silk floral arrangement is quite lovely. With a container, it's $24. It's so beautiful. They have some really neat items, and I like to look at some of the other shelves as well for vintage glass. You never know what you'll find. And some of these items are surprising. For example, let's take a look at this $3 crystal bowl. Let's turn it over and see if we can find a mark 
another great reason to shop resale. Look at all this beautiful glassware. I see some things that are very useful and purposeful. And Waterford Crystal. Here's the Lismore Small Bowl. It is $3. Can you believe that? This is the pot of gold that I found under the rainbow today. So I encourage you to shop your local charity resale because you never know when you will find Waterford Crystal. This lovely pattern is from the Metlocks Company out of California, a company that's no longer in existence. Unfortunately, there is a lot of lead in these dishes. And with the high lead content, you might want to do some research. This brass peacock is regal. It would be great for a tablescape. And for $12, it's a great price. I just don't have a spot for him. In the locked cases near the register, they have some treasures. I found wonderful things here over the years. And take a look at these Belgian crystal candlesticks. They're made by Val Saint Lambert. It's the gardenia pattern. I have these and I absolutely adore them. Perfect for any table setting. And these are my finds today. And I did meet a viewer while shopping today. His name is Kevin, and it was just so wonderful to hear that he was shopping in the store for a housewarming gift, and he has embraced resale shopping. So that was wonderful. I had such fun today at the Hope Chest resale market. I definitely will be coming back again. And I have some great news for you. If you shop here and mention Lady Mary Bath, you get 10% off your purchases. And these are some of my favorite finds today. This special dish that looks like American Brilliant Cut Crystal and the Waterford Lismer Bowl for $3. Of course, this has to be my favorite. Thanks again for joining Lady Mary Bath. Elevate your everyday with resale shopping.